is up guys, it's another food review of Simon Samples and today we've got the lovely Emily's Crisps kindly sent out a little care package of their products so I'm going to be trying the sweet potato, carrot and beetroot today I'm really hoping that these are kind of similar to the um, vegetable crisps um, I'm pretty sure they're going to be similar because it is the sweet potato, carrot and beetroot which they normally have in them. Gonna miss the parsnips though. If you're next making some new products, put some parsnips in there because they are divine. It's 95 calories per packet, which is pretty insane. Carbs are high because you know it's it's vegetables, it's not got much like in the way of protein and things like that. So it'd be optimal for you guys to have this like before you work out or straight after you work out to get some you know glycogen replenished in your muscles get the gains going on. So it says on the back, to Emily, how you make my heart beat, as in B-E-E-T. So, beetroot, you know. So it's a little bit quirky. Peas don't think I've sugar snapped, but a girl as sweet as you should have savory sweet treats from time to time. I made these veg crisps for you, and just like you, they're irresistible love Alex. So it, the kind of story behind it is while um, traveling in the Far East, Emily and Alex, our star fruit crossed lovers, not like them, uh, found a astonishing way to make crisps that preserves their natural tasty goodness whilst creating an amazing crunch. So let's give these a go. Not like crazy amounts of smell coming out of that, but you know, it's uh, a little bit of a waft. That was a carrot. Mmm, that's really nice. It's actually quite sweet. I think the best way to describe this, it's kind of like those um, crisps that you get, the vegetable crisps, but not as salty. And those vegetable crisps do have like a ridiculously high amount of sodium in them. So this is like an amazing alternative. Obviously because there's not so much salt on it, it doesn't have like that really like pungent uh, taste in your mouth, but really, really nice sweet flavor. So yeah, with the carrot, you definitely get that sweet aftertaste, really nice. Try the beetroot. Mmm, beetroot is so nice. Really like that one. What else we got? So I'm guessing this might be the sweet potato. Yep, that was definitely sweet potato. Let's get all three. All three flavors together work really well. Okay, so let's do a rating. Um, flavor, really nice. I really enjoyed that. It's not salty. Um, it's not like bitter or anything. It's got a really nice sweet flavor. Like not too subtle flavor as well. It's not like you'd expect with uh, some things like it's so like um, unseasoned and stuff. It's still got a really nice amount of flavor. There is salt on it obviously. Um, so that brings out the flavor. But obviously no preservatives, no added sugars. It's really, 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 really nice actually. So I'm gonna go for an eight out of 10. Eight out of 10 for that. Um, with flavor, crunch, 9.5 out of 10. I was expecting a little bit more of a crunch, but there's definitely a crunch. Pretty good crunch. Macros, for 95 calories, that's pretty good. So that keeps the rating up a little bit higher. It is pretty much just carbs, free fat, 16.6 carbs, 2 fiber, 0.5 protein, 0.14 salt. Because it's like mainly carbs and this is like a fitness channel, I'm going to say 7 out of 10. Because you could use this, you know, just as a little snack and it is only 95 calories. So but guys, I hope you have enjoyed this one. Check them out on Instagram. Check them out on Instagram, Facebook, and their website, I believe, is also up there. So if you fancy that kind of stuff, give them an order, show them some love, tell them who sent you, 730 Fitness. I'll see you guys in the next one.